consciousness. Today I'm starting with my new ice cream challenge. Seven days uh, full of fresh raw vegan ice cream. I'm very excited to do that. In Germany summer is now somehow coming to an abrupt end. Today we have only 13 degrees in the morning and now it's about 15 or 16 so it's not very nice outside but uh, let's keep the summer feeling on keep the summer feeling going so make some ice cream my first recipe for a nice raw vegan ice cream is a melon ice cream i have two different recipes which i want to show you with a melon very easy ones and very delicious and quick done well let's get started so the first thing is we cut our melon in half so we have two halves here one for later and I will start with my most easiest ice cream. That's it. Make sure they don't stick together, otherwise it would be a little bit difficult to get them out later on. Then into the fridge. Now this gets frozen and you can just eat it like a little ice sticks. Nice and quick done and very delicious. For the other melon ice cream recipe, I use my blender. To make it sweet and creamy, I pick some frozen bananas. I think these were two. All into the blender. There are still some frozen pieces of the banana left, but that's not the problem. So this creamy fill in our um, forms here. deep freezer for a couple of hours. Now I have some of my melon banana juice left but that's no, not a problem. Drink it as a shake. Mm. This is my shake. The other ones are in, the, are in the freezer so let's see in a couple of hours what we've got. Mm. This one is delicious too. Mm. So see you later guys. Hey you guys, some time has passed, so I'm back in the kitchen and I wanted to show you how my melon ice cream is doing. It's not an ice cream, it's these are ice sticks. Unfortunately, I put them the wrong way into the box. So when you do it, you put it upside down, yeah? So that you can take it like this, yeah? But uh, it's, uh, it doesn't matter anyway, it, uh, it's very delicious. I tasted one already. Mm. Sweet and juicy. Mm. Very good. Very good. And it's nice for children, yeah, too. Just uh, take it out of the box and eat it right away. Mm. Very good. So, but we had another one. Sorry, I have to finish this first. Mm. Cool. 
We had this other one also with the banana mixed up in the blender or blended up in the blender. I don't know. We put it under the tap with hot water, some hot water. We just turn it around, put it together again, and that's our ice cream stick. It's a pop cycle. So let's try it. Mm, wonderful. Very juicy, but at the same time creamy from the banana and very sweet. Um, for tomorrow, uh, we're making uh, turmeric ice cream, two varieties of turmeric. You know, turmeric is very healthy. We make two different varieties. One is uh, a, cook, a turmeric ginger ice cream and the other one a turmeric pepper ice cream. And for both we'll need some coconut water. In our uh, grocery store I found this uh, unusual container for uh, coconut water in a tin. If you come from a tropical area, maybe in the Caribbean, please don't use this. Use fresh coconut water from fresh coconuts. It simply is better. But I don't have an opportunity. We have no coconuts in Germany, so I use this coconut water. And we'll put this in the in our little um, ice cube forms and uh, let this let this freeze overnight so we can use it tomorrow for our for our turmeric ice cream. Put it in the freezer and that's all. So this was ice cream challenge day one. Watermelon ice cream pop cycle and uh, watermelon sticks. I hope you like it. If you did give me a like, give me a thumbs up, share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel. We we'll see us tomorrow. Cycles? Is it pop cycle? Yeah, I think. So that was this was ice cream channel 